Hey everyone, welcome back to day two of Vlogmas. I actually didn't upload on December 2nd, so I am going to upload today, December 3rd. In this video, we are getting the tree ready to decorate. Kason actually put the tree up for me while I was still at work this day, and when I got home, um, I was too tired to fluff it or do anything like that so this was probably the next day so I'm just fluffing the tree um, I probably would have made it a little bit easier on myself if I would have turned the lights on but I eventually turn the lights on and um, get any parts that need to be fluffed up to make it look more full I believe this is a six foot tree I got it on sale at Michael's about four years ago it was about a hundred dollars and it's lasted us all four years I did lose one small little branch that popped out um, but for four years of it being used for Christmas only losing one little branch I would say that that is a win and this tree is really easy to put together it comes in four pieces the base the bottom the middle and the top and it's pre-lit so luckily I don't have to light the tree myself so in this video we are just going to be decorating the tree and it's over the span of a few days I hope you enjoy
So as you can see, Kaysen is being a goofball in the background. I had no idea that that was happening behind me until I came to edit this video. He's so silly and goofy and that is some of my favorite things about him. But then we started picking out different ornaments we wanted to hang up. A lot of the ornaments we started with are just like the typical colored sphere ornaments. Um, we did red and gold, silver, green. It's like a dark green color, so very traditional Christmas. And then we started adding in more of our sentimental or fun ornaments on the tree. So you will be able to see all of that. And then at the end, I will go into like the tree branches and show you some more detailed clips of the tree. <laughs>
As you can see, Tonks and Wrangler also wanted to help decorate the Christmas tree, but they obviously can't, so they were there for moral support. Um, I also changed out the tree skirt. I think in the first clip it was our old tree skirt that I had since I was in college. I ended up putting on this vintage one I got from a an, an antique store. It's actually woven together and has a velvet um, like trim around the edges and there's bows that you tie it together with to put it around the tree. It's very pretty. It's multicolored like red and green and cream and it just adds a lot of character to the tree.
here are a few clips of the tree at the end of this little clip the lighting gets really bad probably because it was in the morning time so I did some closer up clips we have a few ornaments from our first Christmas um, after we were married four years ago and then some of these really pretty cross Christmas ornaments and the pearl ornaments I just thought these were really pretty to get clips of we have these ornaments that Kason gets me every year of us he puts a picture on there of something that fun that we did that year and then I have an ornament of um, a paw print for my tonks. And then this really pretty church ornament. And then the other cross ornament that you saw was handmade by my friend Christy. And then I have this needlepoint pillow ornament that my um, aunt gave me. And then our photographer from our wedding gave us this picture of us. Merry Christmas.